Dakota with screen shake is... <laughs> I, I'm not a fan. <laughs> I, I used to think it, it. I used to make excuses for having it on, and I turned it off once. And I thought, "Wow, this game was way better without screen shake on." So now I'm firmly in that camp. Okay, and um, yeah, as we start this race, I will. Uh, I, I I have to confess, guys. I actually am not sure what I want to make the final set of bounties. So I'll let you guys in chat help me out. Give me some bounty ideas, and if I see one I like, I'll go for it. Oh. I'm gonna try to think of one too, then. Like, what's what's a, I, I guess what's a non meme one that? Because my first thought would be, uh, it's RNG based. Like, you take the frog socks and you never turn them off. But I don't know if that's a good one. Yes, I okay. Koopy <laughs> suggested a really good one. Tossy tossy boom boom on DB four or five. <laughs> Hmm. Or just DB in general. Yeah, I don't like that bomb one because that one might just not be possible. If, if the seed doesn't have any bombs, it's just not doable. That's true. I would like it to be something that's consistently doable, but but isn't something that you would normally do. Hmm. Bomb that's a piece really... ring. Oh. <laughs> the pants. Somewhere out call there. It the pants. Somewhere out there, pants just shed a tear. Uh, actually, not even shed a tear. He just he's just smiling for some reason. Like, I'm so happy for some reason. <laughs> so it looks like uh, just doing a quick review of all the the runners. Uh, oh, Yuka froze. Okay, they they froze for a second on my screen, but they're back. Um, they have a decent amount of gold at 169 and 13. And Monster Racer look like, looks like they're farming gold a bit early, too. But I'm not seeing a lot of gold farmed uh, on Abu's or Sivir's side. Not at the moment, at least. Okay, I have one suggestion, maybe. Yeah? Oh, yeah, oh, no, I was, I was about to say, I was, uh, I was killed by Beamy to it. Uh, get as far as you can on low percent. Well, then we can't just have it be as far. Like, like we need to have a clear yeah. victory point. That's yeah, true. No, you're right. You're right. Like, That's like a point. low percent zone. Like, beat zone one low percent is. We can do that. Maybe, maybe even ramp it up to like zone one and two. Uh, that might be a little much. I don't know. But yeah, that might be a big. Screen. Yeah, I, I don't want to do something that's like going to completely hose you for the entire race. Like giving up lucky charm, not um, it, which you you don't even have to do that. You can do the subbeat kill. Um, is um, like oh, oh, isn't that bad? Because you know, bomb like uh, bats are still a threat on Coda, even if you have lucky charm. So it's not the hugest benefit to have lucky charm. It, it helps, but it's not. Uh, it's not going to make or break your run in most cases. That's true. Eli has a good suggestion. Beat a full level with no dagger. <laughs> and that's, again, that's one that's, uh, I don't like as much because, depending on the seed, that might just not be possible. That's true. I, I want it to be something that we know will be consistently doable across all seeds. Yeah, something more feasible than, uh, and not RNG, not terribly RNG dependent. There is some element of RNG to all this, but obviously we don't want to make it uh, impossible. Because this is only probably impossible. So we need something probably impossible. Use three or four shrines. Okay, um, yeah, get me a four shrine category that we've uh, seen in some places before. I like that one. That's, that's pretty that's good. That's not a bad idea. Looks like Abu is in uh, zone two. Uh, actually, wait a minute. Yuka's ahead. I just realized. Okay, so Yuka, um, I'm waiting a moment here. Just dropped down to two three, and Abu is dealing with the the what the, the arena, I believe. Yeah, the arena. Oh no! Oh no! Having to bomb the glass torch. Got to be careful with those bombs. And oh no! Just oh! oh no! <laughs> Abu stepping into the gold, trying to go back for the leprechaun. Oh, oh, oh. oh, what a tragedy. <laughs> Just everything that could have gone wrong in that arena going wrong. That is really unfortunate. 
Can we just have a sympathy bounty for Abu here? Be like, here, here's five bucks for having to go through that. Yeah, have we? I, I okay. Um, we don't have a lucky charm picked up for uh, for Yuka, and they have over five hundred gold. Have we seen the Leprechaun summon on Yuka's side? I don't. I don't recall seeing a Could... Leprechaun summon on Yuka's side. Could we see? The bounty being fulfilled for for uh, for Yuka. We could definitely see that they have eleven hundred gold as of uh, right now on my screen. Yeah, as so. long as uh, we he hasn't already summoned the leprechaun, and we just missed it. It's very doable. There's a blue dragon on three two here. Yeah, blue dragon uh, will do it. Oh, there's a leprechaun. But they, they, oh, they they insta kill it, wouldn't they? Yeah, they would insta kill if they hit it. So they no, have to they give only it up. have two damage. Oh, uh, they oh no, never mind. You're right. You're right. But yeah, just not they, going for it at all. So yeah, no no bounty for uh, for Yuka here. And looks no like they might have. Either. It looks like they might have, but hesitated, and that's all it took because there are some enemies coming at them uh, around the same time the leprechaun spawned. Yeah, and it looks like uh, Monster Racer is bombing shop walls. Monster Racer is going all in on this <laughs> on this bounty, but uh, it's dying to the skeleton on the other side of that wall. So not going to be able to pull it off. And oof, okay, Yuka going down in three, two, right next to the exit. We're seeing a lot of those deaths. Those getting up. Just a wanting to be done here. with the floor, trying to rush down the exit, and getting denied at the last second, usually by moles. And a lot of moles. Yeah, Biggie Mac has a lot to say about uh, getting hit by moles, or at least dying to moles on zone 2 after trying to rush the exit. Uh, it's uh, pretty pretty tragic. So let's see, yeah, we have full exit. Yuka, look, just bombed out some shop walls. So, I'll, uh, I think my eyes are on Yuka right now for attempting the bounty. Yeah, we're about halfway through this at this point. So, like, Yuka could definitely, if they wanted to, just say, okay, 3 is a, a good enough flag plant with how this race is going. I'm just going to try and get that bounty. Like, that's that's that would be a reasonable thing to do at this point. But, um... Oh, the bounce trap! Yeah, it's so unfortunate. Sivir looked oh. like they were really heading for that, working on that bounty with, uh, with almost 500 gold in uh, one three, but the monkey bounce trap is... Ugh. Right at the last second, too. It's so unfortunate. Looks like uh, looks like Abu's back in zone two. And I see a lucky charm on, on them, so they're not going to get the bounty. I think Monster Racer and, and Sivir are both kind of looking at the bounty. I don't think they've even seen the first boss. I don't think so. I, you know, I don't recall. I, I, I've seen uh, obviously Yuka and Abu out of Zone One, but I don't recall Sivir being outside of uh, Zone One at all. So yeah, I'm definitely with you on that. Yeah, muted. We can't exactly tell it. Like we can't. We we're not grabbing player audio, so you know it wouldn't do anything for us on this end. Though, so interesting idea, but also also probably a little bit more extreme than I would want to go. Like, that is... I, I don't know that I want to enforce, like, a uh, try and force a ridiculously hard requirement through an entire run like that. It's more, it's more like the idea I'm looking for is, like, for something that's a little out of the way or a little outside of what you would normally do, but isn't going to just, like, single-handedly make or break your run. Yeah, because the the like the ideas I'm thinking about for bounties are a lot of them are RNG dependent. Uh, the one I just thought of right now is uh, we saw one earlier, um, proc the uh, sacrifice shrine, but that's RNG dependent. So yeah, there's no guarantee. A, we'll you see need it. a sacrifice shrine to spawn, and I think exactly. it's possible that that doesn't happen. Um, oh, and the bounce traps and the bounce traps are out for blood today. Yeah, they're the real winners of this tournament right now. I, th I think it's a tie between moles and bounce traps. And a close second being Wind Mages. So yeah, everyone's back in Zone 1. Uh, looks like Monster Racer just hit their 1-4 boss. Yep. 
And it's just going to pop the Heart Transplant, just going for uh, a safe kill here, just to secure a little bit of a better Flag Plant. Yeah, nothing wrong with that. And they do not have a Leprechaun right now. They don't have a Lucky Charm. But so... they do have the 500 gold, so they can start hunting for it. Ooh. But, well, My well, eyes are on Monster Racer. The thing is, though, they have a lot of damage, so they can't go for the uh, sub-beat kill where they still get the Lucky Charm anyway. If they donate they do to that fireball. Leprechaun... Um, oh wait, yeah, they they do have to. If, yeah, if they want to donate to the leprechaun, they have to use that fireball because um, aggroing the leprechaun is just going to kill it with a with a dip melee attack. And Sivir just this time picked up the miner's cap. Okay, never mind. Uh, swapped off for the uh, <laughs> the spike tears. I was about to say. <laughs> oh no! Monster racer went down. Um. Oh, uh, those moles and, and the the yeah, that wind mage. That's rough. Oh, man, I, I I was trying to see if they were trying to attempt that bounty at that point, but I didn't see it in the time. So I hate to I hate to sound mean, uh, Biggie Mac, but I kind of want somebody to make uh make some uh, cadence sprites for you to be a mole. I don't know why. <laughs> but it would be interesting. Looks like Abu is trying to get through two one. I don't see a lucky charm on their side on the, their side again, so the bounty is definitely open. Yeah, as long as the leprechaun hasn't summoned and gotten away at this point, um, and uh, they're likely gonna break five hundred gold at the end of this floor. Yep, there we go. 500 gold. The option's on the table. Oh. And you could just went down to 2-4 boss again, Kanga. Oh, so unfortunate. Oh, that wind spell, yeah, just tripping them up. Yeah, this is being quite a bit of a bloodbath uh, on this on this race. This bounty is heckin' hard to oh, do. Oh, and the boss. Minotaur getting hit with the Kool-Aid, man. So Abu oh. not going to be uh, improving the flag plant or picking up the bounty here. And uh, Monster Racer is shifting back into full score run mode, bombing the shops, the shop corners, just looking to hit that 500 gold so that they can hopefully uh, secure that bounty before the end of the run. Might as well hit that five bucks at the very least. Uh, that would put them, I think they're in third at the moment. I don't think Sivir's been in zone two, or I could be wrong. Okay, yeah, and um, okay. Mo yeah, Monster, Monster Racer bombing the big gold pile to make sure he doesn't summon the Leprechaun prematurely. So Monster Racer definitely playing with that bounty in mind. Yeah, they, they definitely are. They're back in zone two um, as of right now. So they, they, they made a beeline for zone two. And they have just the right amount of gold to proc it. I believe it's just a, um, a regular nightmare, not the, um, not the strong one on 2-1. Yeah. So yeah, we don't have to worry about... Those can't really get the leprechaun. You won't get blood nightmares unless you're wearing real war. Um, you can get the leprechaun, but it would take a lot of maneuvering uh, enemies around. Yeah, it's not as easy. Oh wait, wait, wait a minute, wait a minute. Monster is luring enemies onto that gold pile. Yeah, he's got to remember he's got too much damage to um, to do things normally uh, with like uh, melee attacks. So if he's going for it, he's got to hit with that fireball spell. All right, learning a wind mage over, uh, bringing a skeleton to the pile. There it is. Oh no, he missed it. Oh, you're oh. You're, you're ahead on commentary. No, no. <laughs> I'm so sorry. I'm sorry. It's it's it's, it's so clutch. I'm sorry. Oh no, it's running away. It's running away. It needs to find a way to line up this fireball. It's getting away, and it's gone. Oh, oh. no. <laughs> oh, that was such an intense chase. <laughs> If he had one more beat, he could have fireballed because it, it, it trapped itself uh, in that little corridor uh, in front of the uh, shop entrance. So he could have definitely fireballed it, but it was just not in time. Holy cow. Yeah, I'll try to make sure to delay. It's just it was so clutch at that, at that moment. I'm like, oh, he got away. It, it's like watching a cartoon chase. It was kind of intense. Okay, let's see. So, uh, yeah, that's going to be it for this one. 
a lot of deaths going for the bounty on this one. Uh, and uh, yeah, the furthest flag plant being Yuka's 3-2. Uh, no one securing the $500 donation to the Leprechaun. So yeah, no bounties this round. Let's uh, yeah, let's let's review the uh, options we've got in this. Uh, um, let's see. Uh, I'm just gonna skim through the suggestions that were given for the uh, for the final bounty in these last two games coming up. Um, let's see. Hey, one round of GGs once again for these racers. They did an excellent job. This sea was rough. The bounty was rough as well, it turned out. And they did a fantastic job managing. Hmm. Let's see. Don't need money to... Or, well, sell, to, sell items to the pawn shop. Uh... Have less gold than a specific amount, but less than a specific amount of gold uh, uh, by a point. Um, let's see. Muted. Uh, don't don't take any glass items. Um, <laughs> hit a scatter trap. Pop some number of shrines. <laughs> Koda without missing a beat bounty. Yeah, okay. Take <laughs> at least three trap doors. Hmm. That's an interesting one. That'd be interesting to see. Hit the exit stairs while confused. Where do confusion traps start? Zone three? Yes. Hmm. But that's not really a guarantee, because what if the confusion trap is on the opposite end of the map? And you don't have enough beats to get to the exit. So that would have to be... That would become a Zone 4 consistent thing. Liches in Zone 4 are guaranteed, yes. But um, that is, it does require you get pretty far into the run. But uh, this one also did require uh, some... Collecting a decent amount of gold, so... Anyway, um, I'll ponder it for a moment while we set up the next race, which is going to be DL Kurash, Yuka 34, was killed by, and Sivir. Also, I have one more idea to throw out for that bounty. What if, um, just do a run without taking the, the Lucky Charm? I mean, we kind of already had people <laughs> practically doing that on this one. True. <laughs> That's true. I, I, I was trying to think of something that was that was easy enough to do, but I guess hard to finish, harder, that makes the run harder somehow. And in that case, if you have a lot of bats, but yeah, it's, it could be anything. Alright, so we're, we're going to go ahead and set up the next race, and we'll be back in a bit. <laughs> 